Hello everyone, today we'll be taking a closer look at how we can use Contember Studio to quickly build a content management system for a software company's website. Our goal is to create a system that allows us to manage the different content blocks of a software company's website. To achieve this, we'll work with two roles, admin, which is added by default, and public, which is also automatically included for all CMS. Now we need to define the types of content blocks for our website. This is a crucial step because it determines what kind of content we can display on our site. As we start defining our blocks, Contember Studio suggests additional content blocks. I'll go ahead and use these suggestions. By combining the blocks I defined and the suggested ones, we end up with the following content blocks. Hero section, about us, services, portfolio, team members, and contact us. Now we are ready to generate our schema. We hit continue, and the Contember Studio does its magic, generating the schema based on our inputs. A quick look over it tells me everything is in order, no adjustments needed this time. With our schema confirmed, it's time to deploy our application. This is an automated process, which is great, so let's initiate it. Our application is now deployed on Contember Cloud. I'll fill in some data to give us a better idea of how the CMS will handle real-world content. Notice how each page has a slug automatically generated based on its title, which is a fantastic time saver. We can also see all the different content blocks we defined earlier. The flexibility of this CMS is incredible, allowing us to arrange these blocks in any order that suits us. And that's how you build a fully functional content management system for a software company's website using Contember Studio. Now it's your turn to give it a go. Head over to Contember Studio and see what you can create. Thanks for watching.